Welcome. I am sitting here with Christina Marie. The first thing I want to ask you about is your website. Mm -hmm. You have so many projects going on. Is it hard for you to differentiate that on your website and get, get traffic still? I'm kind of just really focused on my skateboards, but I still do other types of art. That's just been the main thing that's been driving my business. So it's kind of cool that way that I get to focus on my skateboards and then still do a little bit of everything on the side. I just sent two boards to Canada. I have a board that's, I don't know if it made it to India yet. Someone's supposed to bring that to India. One in England, um, all over the U.S. So it would be awesome if they were on every continent, but I don't know if anyone needs a skateboard in Antarctica. The, the weird thing is like, I don't really promote that much. It's like all word of mouth. It's on Instagram. Like I don't go seeking these people. Sometimes, a lot of times it's them seeing me like with a hashtag of like skateboard or art or whatever. And that's the next big thing with you in the art world. Oh boy. I would love to do a gallery. Like I would love to do a show and just like have my artwork together. I have a lot of friends that are artists. So I've kind of been like throwing around the idea of like having an art show with just my friends and like having uh, inviting other people that I don't know to just be like this is a group of artists that are friends that this is the cool things that they're doing so I think that would probably be like my dream to do that like by the end of this year. Where are you working now and what does your job entail? So right now I'm working for Black House Hospitality. Um, I'm a product manager so I basically oversee the development of all these restaurants from like different phases so we have a huge project coming up in Huntington Beach and we have one in Redondo, we just finished one in downtown LA. So I basically just see, oversee everything. So I'm meeting with the contractors and the designers and the lighting designers and the architects and kind of just like managing everyone's schedule and making sure that we are on this, the right schedule. And it's been awesome. Let's talk job or no job. Oh boy, job or no job. <laughs> <laughs> okay, first, like I already told you, they laugh in personality. It that was is serious. <laughs> it was funny because people would just like be on Hulu or like writing comments and stuff and being like, This girl is great. Like she's got so much personality, but I think it's also like my worth ethic has kind of shifted and I've realized like what I really like and to be honest with you, like sitting behind a desk like doing AutoCAD is not something I want to do for the rest of my life and like I'm like I want to get my hands dirty and I feel like sitting there like a drone just like doing all this stuff like isn't really what I want to do but it was definitely a life learning experience like life changing and a life like I've learned so much from being on that show and I still think it's funny that I was on TV. The one thing that I wanted to do was to show my parents that with art you, you can do something positive which is a lot of the reason why like oh basically all my art is just like these positive sayings and sometimes it's like sports like with sports and stuff so it's kind of like just all positivity and I feel like when you find out what you want to do and what story you want to convey as an artist like run with it and if people don't like it like oh well like I got passed up on a job because I didn't have 10,000 followers in real life but yeah I, like a couple weeks ago I was like posting about this th or I saw an ad or something about influential women who are strong-willed and are doing these in inspirational things and I didn't have enough followers.
Alrighty. Am I looking at the camera or am I looking at you or am I looking at both? You can do either. You can do either. I'm just you know, like, we're going to talk to them and we're going to talk to each other. Okay, okay so it. welcome. I am sitting here with Christina Marie. That is right, right? Yeah. Because I see it on your Instagram, skate, and then I see the hashtag. You got it. A lot of people, they're like, SK8. I'm like, Skate, skate Marie. Hello. Yeah. yeah. No. So yeah. I was like, I don't know. But I was like, oh, okay. So the first thing I want to ask you about is your website. Mm -hmm. You have so many projects going on. Uh, is it hard for you to differentiate that on your website and get get traffic still? It's it's mostly been a lot of my skateboards that I've kind of been like spotlighting for a while. I was like showing a lot of my interior design projects that I was doing in school. So now I've kind of just really focused on my skateboards, but I still do other types of art too. But for some reason, like that's just been the main thing that's been driving my business. So it's kind of cool that way that I get to focus on my skateboards and then still do a little bit of everything on the side. Do you skateboard? Um, I could go. A lot of my friends are skaters. I could put a skateboard together. I worked at a skate shop um, many moons ago when I was younger, so I could put one together. Um, but I could go. I prefer long boards, but I mean, I, could, I guess a good balance. So. I have a cruiser, and uh -huh. it's the worst experience I've ever had. I'd rather be on a regular skateboard mm -hmm. than I'd rather than a cruiser because the wheels are so big. I feel like I'm high up. Yeah. So I'm like, oh my god, I hate. It's kind of just like what you're comfortable with too. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so where do you get the skateboards from? So I've gotten them from everywhere. I've gotten a couple boards from my friends that skate that don't use them anymore. I have boards that broken in half that they were just like, let's make something cool out of it. Um, I buy them online. I kind of just get them from everywhere. Like everyone's always like, oh, I don't use this board anymore. Do you want it? And I'm like, sure. So I feel like eventually with time, I'll do like surfboards and other kinds of boards too. Ooh, yeah. Evan was just asking about that. He's like, oh, I have an idea of a surfboard. It's, um, it's whatever one, if whatever one, um, someone wants to give me, I'll paint on. So right on. Yeah. Okay, so um, what do you think is like the next big thing in the art world or what do you see for yourself that's the next big thing with you in the art world? Oh boy, I would love to do a gallery. Like I would love to do a show and just like have my artwork together. I have a lot of friends that are artists so I've kind of been like throwing around the idea of like having an art show with just my friends and like having uh, inviting other people that I don't know to just be like this is a group of artists that are friends that this is the cool things that they're doing. So I think that would probably be like my dream to do that like by the end of this year. And who do you think your customers are who buy this stuff? Like who are they? Oh gosh, I have so many random people. Like um, a lot of the thing, the, the weird thing is like, I don't really promote that much. It's like all word of mouth, it's on Instagram. Like I don't go seeking these people. Sometimes, a lot of times it's them seeing me like with a hashtag of like skateboard or art or whatever. And so yeah, it's like, it's different. Like, I just sent two boards to Canada. I have a board that's, I don't know if it made it to India yet. Someone's supposed to bring that to India. One in England, um, all over the US. So it would be awesome if they were on every continent, but I don't know if anyone needs a skateboard in Antarctica. That'd know. be sick. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe like a sled or something. I don't know, whatever they're using over there. Yeah. So, uh, wait, we're at our three minute mark. Okay, yeah, that was good. Okie dokie.
It's crazy. It's been a year. It's been a crazy, crazy year since like. I thought it was automatically okay. There is something flickering. What do you like? It? Turn on a light or oh, it's the uh, candle maybe? Oh, it's the candle. Oh, yeah. I'm like, what is it? It makes it look like the. Uh, yeah, I'm like, what is that? Okay. Okie dokie, when you are ready. All right, we'll just take a few test shots so you two just stand up. Stand up? Kind of in the middle right here. Okay. How's the lighting? Do we need to turn on any lights? Actually, his seems pretty bright. Yeah. So there's a light behind you and one over here. So, just stand up in the middle. You're so much smaller in person. <laughs> I'm little. Like, I swear. <laughs> a little See? less formal, like, uh, I don't know. I know. Um, <laughs> Yo. Um, on TV, <laughs> you seem, like, larger than, like... I know. Like, I you was know, like, like, like that's how models appear yeah. to me on TV, too, and then I see them, and I'm like, this Yeah, like, so I've big. seen a lot of, like, random famous people, and I'm just, like, like, Drew Barrymore, I thought she'd be, like, wait, she's, like, my height. I'm like, you're fucking <gasps> tiny. Mm -hmm. I saw her a couple years ago at this concert, and I was like, and I was like, can I take a picture? She's like, I love you too, but no. And I was like, fine. Like, <laughs> I don't want, if I was famous, I don't want people like to bug me all the time. Yeah. But. I don't know. I feel like, like that's the price you pay like without yeah. your fans or nobody. I saw, that's I, true. I saw Chris Rock at the theater and I'm like, I felt bad, but I was like, can I take a picture? Yeah. And I was Did like, he let you? Yeah. He, I was like, congratulations on your new movie. He's like, okay. And I'm like, uh, oh! yeah. yeah, I'm like, do you not care? I went to a movie last night. And they were showing the preview for the movie, um, the O.J. Simpson movie. Okay, with what is Cuba. It? Cuba is one of our regulars at the work, the bar oh, that I work nice. at. So I see him every Sunday and Monday. And, like, he always gives me shit. He's like, why are you still single? He's like, I'm going to go find a boy for you or you, I could just date you. And I was like, you're too old to Cuba. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. He does look like you have a good, a good personality. Yeah, he's awesome. He's a sweetheart. But, like, he's... Him and his his friends always come to the bar that I work at up, this, um, up the street. And they're super nice, but, like... It's weird, like, seeing him on TV and then, like, knowing, like, I've known him for, like, two or three years now, and just, like, seeing him in real life, like, drinking and, like, doing yeah. shit, it's, it's weird. Everybody's that is, normal, though. That is funny. Yeah. So you are working two jobs. Yeah. Like, five jobs, really. I work, so I paint whenever I get a chance, and yeah. then I work nine to five, and then now that it's, like, slowing down a little bit, um, I'm not at the bar, but I used to be at the bar on Saturdays and Sundays, so I'd work every single day. And I'm like, no. That's why the weekends are for me now. Good for you. Yeah. I just like money. And it's, I like money. <laughs> Are you saving for anything special? Uh, I'm going to India in 2017. Ah, that's so cool. Yeah, my, one of my girlfriends from college lives there. So I haven't seen her in like four No, I haven't seen her in like three years maybe. But she's always like, come visit me. And I'm like, shit, why not now? Now that I have a good job and I could like get two weeks vacation easy. All right, we'll, we'll take it right now. A little closer. There you go. Alright, one more. It's still a little too bright. Let's see. One more. Alright, tell me what you guys think. Yes, considering I think you're the worst photographer. <laughs> oh, I'm the worst too. Like I can't take selfies. Like <laughs> this one's alright. This is a little bright, but I still like it though. Okay. That one's a little darker, and that's the darkest one right there. I think they're good. Yeah. Okay. And then we'll take all three. Are we standing this whole time? No. No. I was like, I don't and like then standing. we'll take all three. <laughs>